After going without hot water for over three weeks now, a Collinsville family is questioning whether purchasing a home warranty was actually worth it in the long run. Two Works View problem solver Corey Duke went to work for the family to see what could be done and what to look for when purchasing a home warranty. Danny Ross is on that daily grind, whether it's washing the dishes or making sure the kids are bathed. It's a routine that works until it doesn't. It takes a good 20 minutes to actually get warm water if it will work on any given time. It's an issue spanning over three weeks in the Ross household. Two water heaters. One of them said that there's a motherboard failing, and then the other one just said it's dying. This was kind of all new. Not the best news for this family, who says they jumped through hoops to find out what was wrong, only to be denied repairs by their home warranty company. I did my first service call on August 18th, and it is now September 10th. So I'm well over three weeks in. Danny says she's had a contract with American Home Shield for the last three years, paying $850 annually. This is the first time I've had anything major go wrong, and I'm getting a lot of pushback. Danny says when her hot water takes began having issues, she called her home warranty company, which took over two weeks to perform a service call to diagnose the problem. She says nothing was fixed, so a second contractor was called in. A week later, it was three weeks and I officially got declined on Wednesday for repairing the failing water heaters. Danny says she was told it was denied because of missing parts to her first generation water heaters installed nearly 20 years ago. So I don't understand how I'm being penalized on an item that didn't exist when they were installed in the house. She says her contract states hot water tanks are included in her coverage. And typically plumbing. We sat down with uh, Mike Rhodes lines, with the Oklahoma uh, Insurance Department, who says if you feel you've wrongfully been denied a claim, to reach out. However, there could be uh, uh, a number of exclusions, but one of those could be, and you have to check on the contract, no coverage based upon the age of an, an appliance or a HVAC system or a hot water heater or things of that nature. In 2020, Two Works For You uncovered 13 complaints submitted to the OID against American Home Shield. Four of those filed in August alone. In 2019, 17 complaints. The Better Business Bureau reporting over 12,000 complaints nationwide. So what can you do to make sure you're not dishing out your money for coverage that might not pay off when you need a repair? First, look into the age of your home and appliances and be aware of the detailed contract. If your older appliances might not be covered by a home warranty. To self-insure and to build up a dedicated product or uh, appliance repair or replacement fund. We did reach out to American Home Shield to see why Danny's hot water tank repair was denied, even though it appeared to be covered, and we have yet to hear back. For more information on how to determine if a home warranty is right for you, visit our website at kgrh.com. Corey Duke, two works for you.